All right, let's get right to it. What's behind Hurricane Gabriel? That is the big question we have for you today. We have two waves out in the Atlantic that forecasters are watching. One is just off the coast of Africa, the other one farther out to sea. Let's start with the one that's just off the coast of Africa. This wave has a 10% shot at developing in the next two days and a 60% shot at developing in the next seven. If it were to develop, it would be the next tropical depression or storm or hurricane after Gabriel. So this is something we're watching. You can see where it's kind of in a cluster of islands there. Watch what happens over time. It kind of comes out, starts to develop a little bit, then gets absorbed by land. And that's the frustrating thing about this area is that it's basically being fed by land. The water temperatures there are very warm, but the land kind of puts a damper on things. So we'll see what happens with that wave. It has a long way to go. It's almost due west of the Cabo Verde Islands. Let's take a look at the other wave. This wave out here has a 0% chance over the next two days and a 60% chance over the next seven. This wave, though, is really far out to sea. So even if it were to develop, it wouldn't be coming towards the United States. It would probably go up towards, maybe up towards New England or something like that. But the good news is the water temperatures out there are not nearly as warm as they are down here. So even if it were to develop, it would be a non-issue. It would fizzle out quickly, so we're really not concerned about that wave. The main thing we're concerned about is the wave that's near the coast of Africa. Again, if it were to develop, it would be the next storm in line after Gabrielle. Right now, though, all the forecast models are showing that it's going to fizzle out before it even gets to the Lesser Antilles. So we're in pretty good shape, I would say, for the next week or so. But you can never say never with these things. They can pop up out of nowhere, and we've seen that several times this season already. Well, folks, that's all the time we have for today. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you next time.